Last December, a ceremonial groundbreaking took place, signaling the creation of the historic Westside Legacy Park. This piece of drab desert will soon become a city-county collaboration, a place of reverence, reflection, and recreation. The most unique feature is an interpretive walking trail that weaves through the park, offering a historical narrative that tells the story of West Las Vegas. It is my pleasure to announce the first group of people who will be honored in this new park. Uh, William, Bob, and Anna Bailey, Shirley Barber, Marion Bennett, Larry Bowden, Hattie Canty, Dr. John and Barbara Creer, Ruby Duncan. A total of 36 innovators, icons, and pioneers who shared the historic West Side will be forever enshrined at Legacy Park a small tribute for a group of giants in the community. We talked about the history, uh, the rich history that is celebrated within the community, but now we have an opportunity through the West Side Legacy Park, the historic West Side Legacy Park, to memorialize them for future generations to know the shoulders that they stand on and, and the folks who have blazed a trail uh, for them today. The $3.2 million park is located near Martin Luther King Boulevard and Mount Moriah Drive in the city's Enterprise Park development area. Well, I was in the forefront of fighting the segregation in South Carolina and in Atlanta. Then we came out here and I was shocked to see the, the condition of Las Vegas. Many of the legendary heroes to be recognized at Legacy Park are deceased, but their words, stories, and memories live forever on several exceptional documentaries. Because Clark County Television is proud to showcase many of them during Black History Month. Throughout February, viewers can tune in to see Invisible Las Vegas, The Misunderstood Legend of the Moulin Rouge, and more. These remarkable films go in-depth as they explore the history of segregation in the Valley and issues facing West Las Vegas and the African-American community. You know, we were used to dealing with you know, with the racism and the discrimination and the police, you know, were always there. The Rancho High School riots retells the story of a tumultuous era from 1967 to 1973, when racial tension turned into violence at the North Las Vegas school. This movie and the others will be shown many times in February during Black History Month. Check out ClarkCountyNV.gov for dates and times.